game contains scenes of explicit violence and gore. So if you are over the age of 18, you won't even remember this game coming out. <laughs> oh, you're under the age of 18, sorry. Um, but you may in fact be shocked by the incredible, the realistic violence. Check that the thing is capturing it. Yes, it is, and we're going. Cool. So we're going to play through Leon now, because last time I played through Claire's A story, and as I said, then there are like I turn the volume down a little bit. Uh, there are two characters, and um, what's awesome is that you can play as them. Two of players, each character in any order. When you complete the game as one character, you make a save, and then you load the save as the other character, and you play through the other side of the story. So there's kind of like four combinations, and they're a little bit different. And the best order for me is Leon, uh, sorry, Claire first, which we did the other day. You can find it on uh, Twitch probably still, and uh, I'm putting them videos up on YouTube. But uh, Leon B is where it's at because it's just like a boss run. There's just loads of cool stuff. The T virus outbreak in Raccoon City. Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors. A young girl named Sherry. However, behind their escape was the lone survivor of the Raccoon City Police Department. Leon S. Kennedy. Leon S. Kennedy. The true survivor. Dush. And what's awesome as well is that even this intro video changes as well. So if you play Leon first, you see him in his jeep, but then he does goes through some of the same things that Claire does, I think. Although the crash is different, that's like probably the biggest thing. But, but uh... <laughs> guys had it rough. He needs to up his resolution. Why'd he bite me? Taxico. Taxico, is it? I don't know. Tax and go. Man, what a mess. Pay your taxes on the moon. This. What was that? People? I don't know. Drunk people? Don't move! Don't move! No! Yep, instantly. He doesn't. <laughs> Could just be a homeless person, but he blows the, her brains out. He's not that bad of a cop. You have completed your training, Leon. Wait! Don't shoot! Get down! Oh dear. We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Sure, Leon. Naive, Leon. That's the that's the f <laughs> the first and last time she ever listens to him in this entire game. <laughs> that's probably why. Like you took me to the police station, and it was even worse. Never listen to you again. What's going on? I arrived in town and the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Oh, it's just Raccoon City Cannibal Festival. Stay on the job. Great. <laughs> have this every hey, summer. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother Chris.
Man. We don't see that many 18-wheelers in video games anymore. I feel like there were so many <laughs> back in the day. They were like 18-wheeler uh, driving games in like the arcades and stuff. Where the hell have they gone? Actually, there's probably like 18-wheeler simulator or something, but... Team wheelers were like badass back in the nineties. Okay. Still in one piece. <gasps> it's probably after Terminator 2 thinking about it. <laughs> that probably inspired all the 18 wheeler stuff. Although Terminator 1 had the big truck as well, so. Take it back to 1986, whenever the first Terminator came out. I'll meet you there. Okay, we're playing as Leon. And we're at the other side of the crash. If you watched the first game or if you know the game, we're on the other side of this burning lorry. At the same time, at the same place, you have to survive this nightmare. To know the true end. Oh shit. Uh, I forget the buttons on the roller. There we go. And we're in HD mod as well, which is like AI upscaled. And it's a lot. It's a lot nicer, actually. It runs straight through. And we do get to the police station a lot quicker. At this side of the um, crash. Now if you play Claire, no sorry, if you play Leon first, he starts on the other side of the crash. The first character is always on the right side of the crash. But the wrong side of history. <laughs> No, actually they're on the right side of history, because that's the, the canon <laughs> game. But anyway, um, found a key, and we can get through the back door. And you'll start to remember areas that we were visiting before. Like this place. Got some handgun ammo, and we start with a lot less ammo. I'm pretty sure we had a whole thing of bullets before. That was zombies coming through the gate. I think if you open this, the zombies come through. Like they did. Yeah, see, that's what happened when you play as Claire as well, but... Leon managed to get through before those zombies broke down the gate. The GameCube definitely has lighting as well for the characters that the PlayStation doesn't, which is awesome. I've never played the GameCube version until the other day, because this is what the, the mod is for the GameCube release. And uh, it's pretty cool, actually. Oh, shit. I'm so sad they didn't recreate this in the remake. Why didn't they? Besides laziness, budget or whatever. I should stop complaining about it. I think the whole first playthrough with me complaining about the remake. <laughs> it's, so, it's so stupid and cool. Oh my god. And Leon is like 10 feet away. Luckily, totally didn't get hurt. But that's why there's a crashed helicopter. Uh, nothing I can do here yet. I need the valve still for that. We are coming in the back way. As uh, Leon likes to do. <laughs> oh, they're all the crows are here. Hey then. It's just uh I don't know. Where do I go first? Oh shit. Uh I think I go through this way first, right? Actually, I have to remember this stuff. Oh, 
let's see if we bump into Claire. We don't. We don't. She's not. She's not running around at the same time. Wouldn't it be incredible if they like memorized your movements <laughs> and made it happen uh, during this campaign? That'd be pointless, but an immense amount of technical work. But yeah, the valves here. Okay. Oh yeah, I have manual aiming. Because that's how you play Resident Evil. <sighs> no auto aim here. Kinda gives you a little bit more to do. I knew he wasn't dead. Come on guys. Come on, Leon is a meat feast. Human meat feast. Nice. The HD ness is gorgeous. Now, is this the same as the first game? It is. There you go. Which is kind of cool, actually, because that means that you know how to get in quicker. Remember from the first playthrough. Now, obviously, don't question it too much and go, well, hang on, why was anything there when. Uh, Claire went to it. Don't think about it. Don't question it. I guess we'll take it, I don't know. Where do we get the the shotgun? So remember. Alright, well we can use the bow thing, so I guess I'll just do that. Use the valve. First, open that water tank and quench the fire on the helicopter, just like Claire did. But she didn't do it because Leon did it. He's the true survivor. Claire's game was almost a dream. Some of it still counts. <laughs> I think I get better goodies though than Claire. Cause I think, what did she get? Oh, just handgun ammo, right? I think Leon gets shotgun shells. Um, and it also means I can get. See, this is there's something to think about though. I'm like starting the game. Like, this is stuff that we did probably. Oh, what is it? On my playthrough, I play it through very slowly, but we're like half an hour, 45 minutes into the game I did this. Maybe, maybe, I'm not sure, as Claire. Whereas now I'm doing this early and then I'll be doing other stuff later, so it's a little... A little different. But what is happening? Lord, what's happening in there? <sighs> and you don't want to go through this door now, <laughs> but you fucking have to. <laughs> that moment is so good. On the first playthrough, you're like, shit, man. Oh. Dude, so you can't... Can't open it because of the debris. Let's hope you got... Oh, shit. You can't uh, even run through him because he pushes you back. So you gotta take him out. This is the old Mr. X. He was only in the B game. Uh, well, there you go, I can run past. Now, when he does that swing, you can. I can't remember if you get stuff off him though. I know you do, obviously. I'll like Nemesis and Resi 3, but I can't remember if... There you go, when he starts swaying. Bush, he's dead. There you do, that's good. Right, I'm not sure that makes up for the... 
all the bullets are just ploughed into him. But wait, oh, do I get stuff off this guy? Yes, 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 nice. That's classic Mr. X. Only in the B games. Uh, on the original. So. I don't remember. Let's go this way. I did cut the fire off. And he's alive. Oh, shit. Now, I've got to remember. Preen. Oh, there's a liquor on the, uh, Leon's game. Forgot about that. More difficult to be games. Although, give me a ton of ammo. Not that it accounts for much. It's pistol ammo. Uh, I need to put this away before I can pick up that key. Yeah, like... A suggestion of being hunted by an enemy that you can't take down. This is the first time that's happened uh, in Resident Evil land. Well, I can't use that, and I don't need the knife. Never need the knife in this game. Get a small key. Because if you notice as well, Leon's has the lighter as his special item. His personal item. Claire has the lockpick, which opens simple locks, like in the first game. Um, which Leon can't do, so he needs those little keys. Uh, we read this in the first game, so you don't need to read it again. But then Leon has the lighter, so I don't need to do those puzzles. Uh, I've actually got... I was going to go into that room, but I think there is some shotgun shells, but I don't need to get them. Oh, you can go through here. Cool. But yeah, I guess you can kind of see the evolution into uh, Nemesis Put down the ladder, so we can get down to the to the start of Claire's game down here. But yeah, you can see the evolution into Nemesis really with a sort of enemy that won't die that chases you. Although Mr. X uh, doesn't behave quite like Nemesis, and then also when you play hard mode in Resident Evil Three, you can get um, items from Nemesis. Which is cool. The whole bunch of enemies here that you're not even <laughs> seeing. Oh, they're all the way down here. Because there is actually an item down here. Um, I do wish I could play hard mode, but it's not on the GameCube, I don't think. Which does make enemies bloody ridiculous bullet sponges. Unicorn medal. She wasn't there when you played as Claire, because um, the locations of stuff does change. Can I get through here? No. Oh. It's locked. With the card... Um, key card that needs to be used on the computer, which is what Claire had to do as well. Um, oh, here's the shotgun. Nice. That will be useful. That explosion sound when it stops. Kapow. Uh, the club key. Which isn't a key that you get at this point. Um, I've already... No, sorry, it's not the club key, is it? It's the spade. I always... That next up. Oh, this one's locked. Cool. actually think they all locked down there. Yeah, I have to go back up and round. Because you can 
if you go through that back uh, entrance, like the fire escape, and down, that means I can uh, end up at the other side of the locked door. Where the uh, prison cells were, or the interrogation rooms. And then do that. Which is cool that they sort of take a, an area that you know and then mix it up. But actually, that's really cool because, you know, the whole point of these games is to like learn where you go, what you do, and all that, where the items are and stuff. And so to kind of take that puzzle and mix it up is really nice, in my opinion. Might as well uh, put your um, levels to good use. Got to remind myself again. I'm pretty sure this is hearts, right? Yeah. That the guy just like looks at you as you walk past. Hey, you're not dead. Now you are. And stay down. Oh shit. <laughs> I had a brief memory just before. I thought they were all going to be lined up, but they're like, uh. Oh boy! Yeah. Take a bite of peach. Kind of a waste of <laughs> shock and ammo, but uh, it's fun. And we can open these on the, from the other side. Wait. I always think there's something here, but that's just in Code Veronica because that's the game where they really just started to. Um, reference the classic games, you know, which they've done so much in all of the Resident Evils. Co Veronica was like, let's recreate some of the rooms and just to be nostalgic. But there is uh, ammo there in the in Code Veronica. Can I yes. Now is the liquor here? Yep, but he's on the ceiling. Oh shit, and I used all my shotgun ammo. Also, look on the floor, you can see like saliva dripping, <laughs> which is pretty cool detail. No, 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 no. Wait, where's this shit? I thought there's stuff in here. What the fuck? Missed. Too slow. Okay, well, wasn't ready. And I haven't got actually... I'm still in fine, but that does mean... I have, I'm probably like... Pretty much into caution, I guess. Wait, what? What do I do? <laughs> I thought this was the place to go. The spade key. The spade key. Okay, maybe I do go in the room that I... am blocked with the fire. I thought I needed the red uh, jewels though. Get anything out of it. Ah, good old regular coffee. They just love it in this place. They really do. Cup of Joe, as I believe the Americans say, the Yanks. You yank in my chain. Uh. Pick up some of this shit, I guess. Because it's here, why not? It's free, it's growing. In the garden, in the, what, in the garden, whatever this little area is. 
I'll use it because I'm damaged, so I might as well. You do get plenty. I mean, no normal isn't very hard, um, to be honest. But it sure is fun. Club key. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll just go to that room with the that I cleared. As we douse the fire. Oh, maybe I get something from the helicopter. I don't remember. Let's try. Let's just walk. Man, they are so much more alert than they were on the PlayStation. <gasps> oh shit, he actually got me. Fuck. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they weren't like this on the PlayStation version. Uh, I don't need ink ribbons. I need medical assistance. I thought there was shotgun shells in there, though. Hey. They're hiding down here. Uh, bollocks. Bullocks. Let's use the thing. Right, so I could have done this and been way more efficient. Oh, fuck. Whoa! I'm gonna equip the shotgun, but I'm gonna... See, it's just way more dramatic <laughs> than the first one. It's kind of insane, they just like piled everything into this one. Uh... Oh, you've got to be... Might have taken me a second to ha grab the handle, <laughs> but... Uh... Leon is invincible when he goes through doors, it's one of the weird things about him. Why they made him a police officer, in fact. Uh, put that away, put the shells away. I mean... Let's keep the shotgun. It's cool, I like running with the shotgun. Might be slower, not actually sure. But uh... It looks pretty cool. Like the feel of the pump action. Now oh, we can unlock the doors. Which you can go through the top first. Do I still have it? No, it's gone. Good. Good. Not sure if there's any benefit to going through the library first. Nice try. We did read, read that one as well before, so... Oh, bloody hell. Let's start using the pistol, because I need to... ...be a bit cleverer. Although I did, um, save... ...the machine gun... ...for Leon. Which basically, like... ...kills one boss. <laughs> Although, I might, maybe I shouldn't take them, I don't know. Because there's also the side, also the side pack, which like completely counteracts the uh, uh, the machine gun taking up two spaces, basically. Blimey. But it is a bit easier, so maybe I just won't pick them up. What am I doing? Trying to cram shotgun shells into pistol. Drop off the shells. Oh, I'm not running with any gun. <laughs> Looks pretty cool though. Got a bit of a Terminator 2 run. T1000 run. Slicing. Hands. Cut. Yeah, the liquor. Uh, 
Oh, he's not here. Hey. It feels good to use keys and get rid of them. Uh, there is a mod called the Seamless HD Project. And uh, it only works with the GameCube version though. But it comes, if you go to the website, you just t search up, I don't know, Resident Evil. I think Resident Evil 2 HD and it comes up with this mod. Um, but the download comes with the emulator. And so you just need the ISO for the Resi 2 game. And it's uh, got AI upscaled backgrounds and stuff. Looks pretty damn good. Wait, seriously, is that all I got? I've <laughs> I haven't played this in a while, but I guess that's all you get from this room, huh? Fair enough. Bloody B game, okay. Probably didn't even need to take that. Oh yeah, but I do have the lighter so I can straight away get the first red jewel. You are, have to be kidding. Just had to grab hands for Claire and they're jumping through for me. Uh, let's use the layer. I think the other jewel is still in the uh, in the statue. I'll just grab that. Actually, there's literally no point in me grabbing files. I'm, I'm, I've read them last time. I'll let you try and read the new ones, I guess. Well, do I need to waste... Well, I need to equip some weapon. There we go. Gotta get their attention. I think I think I guess the idea is like Claire probably cleared out these corridors because <laughs> uh, they were full of enemies and now they're not. So hopefully she's doing all the hard work, but she's not taking the handgun bullets, which is good. Man, if they'd actually made it so that like your item pickups were carried over, that would be like. It'd actually be awesome if a mod did that. I'd love to play that. Actually link all the items. Well, besides the key items, but... Uh, link ammo and stuff. So you can only pick them up once. That would be... pretty cool. Run into walls. Hey, I mean, Claire could have at least done this bit. In fact, she did. So I wonder who, what fuck is running around, <laughs> putting all the statues back in place. Must be like Chief Irons or something. So I get so pissed off about these things. enough can I no come on dude wait have I got it stuck come on. great
Ooh, the GameCube does have more advanced lighting though, it's pretty... Obviously it's not like crazy good, but it's... Definitely a step up from the PlayStation. And the PC actually. Red Jewel, finally. Breaking my back trying to get that thing. Let's ignore those guys for now. <laughs> there is no Sherry in uh, Leon's game though. He gets to meet a special someone else. Oh, I checked that and it's always Resident Evil 3 that has it, isn't it? <laughs> it never it never changes. It's always Resident Evil 3 that has the Healing I am. Uh, and I think it's Resi 3 that has a handgun bullets there, right? I don't know. Uh, I think that's it that's in here, so... Magnum's pretty good though. Of course, Leon doesn't get the grenade launcher, but he does get the Magnum. I'm gonna use handgun bullets because... I should probably save the good stuff. I'll waste it on these uh, clones. Seriously, all police officers look the same to me. <laughs> Especially when they're, they're all the same zombie. Come on. Come put one of the variation in here. Man, first day on the job, he has to kill all of his colleagues. <laughs> is, I guess he's killing the competition, right? He wants to become, uh, I don't know, sergeant, superintendent, hey, superintendent Johns. Oh well, what what is there to do? He dropped a key though. Super important diamond key. Which means... oh no. Oh no, diamond means I can get the cog for the attic. Leon. Right, I think. Claire, you made it. Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous. And it's super cool seeing the uh, Leon, I'll go look for her. context for these conversations from the other side. Of course, but before I forget, here's a radio. It's a radio. We're never going to use it again. That way like twice in the whole game. Comes up. See, there's not much to talk about. I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Don't tell me what to do. Desk is. Oh, I need the simple lock, don't I? Simple key, rather. Got the lock. We don't have the key. Oh shit! Oh, they do come through both. Fuck! I'm pretty sure that's broken in the PlayStation. Right? Am I crazy? I'm sure it doesn't matter if you do one of them like PlayStation, but... That's cool, so if I had put the barrier up, the wire, then one of those corridors would be safe. Although I don't think you ever really need to go down <laughs> the, um, uh, like the police corridor again, the, whatever, not the basement one. Switch to slide the shelf, right. It'd be interesting if they made that puzzle a bit different, I guess, but... Uh, well, it wouldn't be that interesting, but... <laughs> it would be one more thing to remember. Um, so I don't, have, I don't have the crank. But we can get the cog.
Do I need to drop an item off? Uh, yeah. Although it might be the only place that diamond key is used. I don't remember. Throw these in. Oh, we have both red jewels though. Let's do that. Oh. Shits and giggles. What do we even get? I guess it's another key. I mean, oh, maybe the heart key. Uh, from that one, I don't remember. Fuck off. Leon is way too quick. Hey, what? <laughs> oh, for God's sake. <laughs>